Advice for taking the sergeant's exam or any exam in a promotional process at a police department. Here we go. Number one, you've got to figure out how to promote people at your agency, what the process is about. Is it an oral board? Is it a written? Is it performance? Uh, is it not performance? Is it about rubbing elbows with the right people? If you have interest in getting promoted, figure out what's the best way to get promoted and begin to focus your energy and effort on that. Number two, when you figure out how to get promoted, you've got to commit to spending time to going through the process of getting promoted. It's a real honorable thing to want to get chevrons or bars or any kind of collar brass because I'm guessing that many of you are taking the promotional process for the right reason, or at least I hope you are. I'm going to throw this one in as number three. It's never a bad idea to know case law and practice case law as much as possible because nothing makes a police department recognize you more. On a meritocracy level, that means for merit, you're so worth it that they're going to promote you. A lot of times this can actually defeat the nepotism process or political process where somebody knows somebody to get promoted. When a police department knows that you know the law better than anybody else at your agency or maybe even in the county you work in, you are like the goose that laid the golden egg. Even if your agency doesn't appreciate your knowledge bases on case law, I can almost assure you that your reputation will precede yourself and you'll have other agencies reaching out for you to go, hey, come over here, we want somebody like you, and we have a promotional process in place that's perfect for a guy or girl like you. Hopefully you found value in this video. It's not the only thing to know about trying to get promoted. It just is a little bit of an insight of how to get started. Good luck.